you know, I don't really enjoy doing this. So I found this game that it's been a very long time since I've found a game and said, you know what? I don't, I don't think I want to play that. I was a victim of some really bad hauntings when I was a kid in the house that I grew up in. I know the true fear of demons. And this, besides Kojima's PT Silent Hill, is the only game that has made me feel that same fear I felt when I was going through the real thing. Why are you playing horror games? It looks so terrifying that I don't know if I really want to finish the whole story. It's about three hours long. And this is the main menu. You know, you can tell a whole lot about a game when you see the main menu. If the main menu is crappy, it most likely will be a crappy experience. But this, this looks kind of fucking creepy right now. But now, now it's the moment where I have to hype. Wow, oh, what the fuck is in that? This is the moment where I have to hype myself up and just convince myself that this is merely a video game. Guys, as always, my name is Hollow and welcome back to Infliction. This is the place between places. Here, there can only be sadness and resolution. This is where the lost are found and vengeance rears its ugly head. Vengeful souls are born of violent death. Okay. All right. Guys, <laughs> I don't typically ask for likes, but it'll really help out a soul in need right now. Okay. You have one unheard message. First unheard message. Hi, baby. I'm stuck at the gate and they won't let me through. When you get back home, can you look for my ticket? I must have left behind. Have a good look around and let me know. Love you. See you soon. So supposedly this was supposed to be a, ha a happy family. This message. Of course, until things just go sideways. Is that my house? Okay, no, that's just a, a random accident, unfortunately. I'm trying to hear the radio, see if it's got anything to do with... Oh, God. Um, alright. I have no words. <laughs> What do I new tutorial unlock check to your uh, check under gameplay in the menu to view tutorials. So we've got one objective right now. And that is to find plane tickets. Now I've got a question. Why is everything here so dark? I'm going to take the flashlight. Yes. Perfect. Okay, that is my car, a very raggedy... Uh, actually, you know what? It's just dirty. I thought it was banged up, but it's it's quite the classic. So this is our garage. Uh, this is where uh, boys become men. This is where I test my manhood. Holy crap. Shut down. Sh close that fridge. I don't know why I have a random just piece of cement just casually hanging from the ceiling of my garage. It's kind of weird. Anyways, uh, right now we're supposed to find the plane tickets. Hello? Okay, this is actually extremely creepy. <laughs> I'm gonna try and find a way inside so I can find my wife her uh, plane tickets. It's because uh, that's what a good husband does. And now we've got a very nice atmosphere. So we're outside. Typically when you're outside in a video game, it's not so scary unless, you know, Unless it's intended for it to be scary. And right now, I don't think it's intended for it to be scary. This is my backyard. Okay. Not that you guys care, but I'm just trying to play along here. Okay. So now, this is where the madness begins. We're going to enter the house. And here we go. Okay. I'm going to close my door. You know what? Actually, I'm going to leave that door open just in case. Welcome to my kitchen. You can see that uh, we are indeed a very happy, happy family. Oh, look at my wife. Is that really my wife? Dang, girl. Ooh. 
So, good versus evil. Introduction. Yeah, I'm not really going to sit here and read all of this. It looks like it's June of 1999, so we're not really in the year 2000 even yet. This is a puppy picture, and the new tutorial has been unlocked. Check under gameplay and the menu to view tutorials. Okay, so... Where, where's the gameplay tutorials? Gameplay. Difficulty. Uh, interactions. Tutorials. Okay, so we know how to do that. You can interact with most objects in the world. Interactions vary uh, from opening doors to picking up objects. That's a big box. What is it? Wow, nice rafting skills. Hmm. Oh my god, a puppy. I can't believe you did this. I love her. I'm gonna call you Sally. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, hi, Sally. Welcome. Now it's time for your gift. Welcome to the family, Sally. <laughs> You can take a look How at these. Clever our little girl is. I'm I'm not sure exactly what's going on here, but she can already draw better than I can. She takes after her daddy. Okay, so we actually also have a daughter by the name of Maggie, and she's three years old, or at least she was when she drew this picture. Uh okay, just take a look at the fridge, see if we've got some Ooh, we got some good hot delicious uh, frozen pizza. Okay, um, we can interact with a lot of things, as you guys can see, thanks to this Unreal Engine. But right now, I'm going to go ahead and shut the door. All I am doing is looking for my wife's tickets. I don't want to get uh, carried away here. I have a feeling the tickets are definitely not going to be in the kitchen. I have a feeling they're probably going to be inside the bedroom, and that's somewhere I really don't want to go to right now. So, <laughs> yeah. So, the meat is thawing on the sink. I'll call you later. Loves PS. Uh, it's trash night. Listen up. We've got some news hot off the presses. This station has received reports that the two lighthouse keepers from Oxford Point Island Lighthouse have vanished. The lighthouse keepers work in three-month shifts. On the shift change, two more lighthouse keepers headed out to the small island to relieve them. Okay. Radio actually works. Welcome to the house. I'm going to uh, turn on all the lights. As many lights as possible. Okay, was that my dog? Okay. Okay, so I don't know if this is our master bedroom, but uh, I don't think the tickets are in here. Um, now, if, if my wife could have... <gasps> what the fuck is that? What is that? Hello? Puppy? Okay, this is definitely the master bedroom. I'm gonna turn on the lights, just because uh, we need lights. Absolutely no way we're not turning off the lights. Mm -mm. Okay, this is possibly actually not the master bedroom. This is the, the theater of some sort. Okay, open up the next light. Uh, then I can even speak right now. The next door. Hello? Okay, we've got a nice little chimney there. I don't even know if I want to go inside. Okay. If there is anybody out there... I swear on the name of Jesus Christ, I will kick your ass! <laughs> Look at my handsome self. And that's my baby girl. What up? Ooh. Sorry, I'm just kind of like, uh... Do you, Sarah Angel Adage, take Gary Ryan Pop to be your lawfully wedded husband? To have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, until death do you part. I do. I don't know why, but these memories are actually extremely fucking creepy. <sighs> all right, I'm gonna turn on this light as well. This house does not seem that big, but all of a sudden, um, it's getting bigger and bigger. And for some reason, my guy can't even sprint. I don't know why he can't sprint. Sprinting would be extremely helpful in a situation like this where something pops up and then I could just run away But uh, unfortunately my man doesn't know how to run so uh, Before I head on the other side. I'm gonna check my answering machine Friday June 4th 4 15 p.m. Oh uh, It's Mike here. I got a message earlier asking about changing the code to your security door 
All you need to do is enter the code, follow the steps I told you on the day I installed it. I wrote the code on the back of my business card. If you have any problems, call me during business hours and I'll be happy to walk you through it. Thanks. It's Mike. All right, Mike. So this is actually a newspaper based on the lighthouse mystery, the people, uh, the people that vanished, which is pretty much what we heard earlier on the Friday, radio. June. What is this? Oh, okay. So we've got a phone number. Rosie Brown, five 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 two five five one. All right, guys. Here we go. This seems to be the door that connects to the other side where we came from at the beginning. Um, see if these doors open up. They're all locked. Oh, hell no. Turn up. Turn off that light. Do not. You, don't you dare to turn off the lights on me. That is a picture of grandma. Grandma's looking freaky as ever. Freaking Jesus Christ. Door is locked. The alarm is definitely on. We're going to head upstairs. I believe the tickets, unfortunately for us, are upstairs. And upstairs is definitely not where I would have be right now oh i've actually got feet oh, what's up bro? pretty serves no purpose it's good to know that we can see our feet for whatever reason it may be it adds to the realism of the experience and here we go this is definitely the master bedroom i'm gonna turn on the light every single light is going on in this house this door is locked and i would assume if this is the master bedroom then this is exactly where we've got the plane tickets Pleasant Falls security doors, 0516. So this is the letter that Mike, or the business card that Mike was telling us about. Plain text. So Pleasant Falls security doors, keypads, deadbolts, cameras, custom request, 555-0516, call for free quotes. I think I'm actually gonna have to remember that, 0516, 0516. Okay, I'm gonna open up the drawers, the cabinets, everything's locked. Don't mind my dirty underwear. We were just having sex last night. Look at all my girl's panties. Holy shit, exposed. Close, the, close them up. Okay. Welcome to my bathroom. That is me, myself, and I. That is merely my reflection in the mirror. And I'm sorry, I'm actually talking a whole lot. I'm just uh, extremely nervous. Whenever I get nervous, I just tend to talk a lot, even when I'm not supposed to be talking. It's the only way that I can kind of relieve myself from all this nightmare. Okay, so I don't think the tickets are actually here. I honestly have no idea where the tickets are at right now. I do have a feeling this game is doing this all on purpose, just to scare the living shit out of me. Okay, what is this? A baby monitor. Maggie? Hello? Maggie? Maggie? Hi, baby. What is making that noise? All right, we've got a toy chest in here. Uh, this is just my daughter's clothes. No need to panic. This is simply just her room. Yes. <laughs> Little kids rooms are fucking scary. Okay. We've got a puppy there. We've got the alphabet. Okay. We're just uh, proud parents of a nice, beautiful young girl who likes to draw. And uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. So I don't know why there was a big, loud noise in there because it was literally just the closet. And this house is actually bigger than I was anticipating. I don't like this. Oh, freaking crap. Maggie's room. Okay, so this is Maggie's room. Hello? Maggie? Please tell me you're not here. Let me in. Holy fuck, Maggie. You are... Oh. Dude, what the hell is that? It's gotta be the dog. Oh, Mass Effect. Cool. Okay, so, uh... We like video games. That's... Actually, I'm gonna turn that off. Oh, shit! Fuck! Turn that off! See if Maggie's got some condoms in here. I'm gonna catch her slipping. I'm gonna put her ass in timeout. Okay. So... Maggie's room is okay. It's free and clear. I'm gonna open up the next room. It's... It's locked, unfortunately. I'm actually... Oh, God. Here we go. 0516 was the key code, right? 0516. 
Yes, I... I am a genius. Okay. <sighs> Welcome to our office. Oh, freaking crap. What is that? Why would you even draw that? Okay. Plane tickets. Plane tickets. Where are the plane tickets? Holy fucking crap. Okay. Where are the plane tickets? This is the plane ticket. Here we go. I've got the plane ticket. Find the plane tickets. Objective has been completed. I don't even want to turn on the computer. I don't want to get sidetracked here. Okay, nothing else. This is just computer instructions. Um, Goddamn, this is spooky as hell. All right, so we've got the plane ticket. No, 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 no. I'm going into the corner right now. Holy freaking crap. Hello, 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 hello. 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 Stop it. Open the damn door. Open the goddamn door, you stupid stinking. Open the freaking door! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god. Hey, um, what are you doing? What's with the mask? New objective, get the hell out of there. Holy fuck. Hello? I've got a flashlight. Open up? No, not opening up. That's okay. Um, let me use the bathroom real quick. Take a quick shit. No, not available. It's okay. Hello? Oh my god! I'm going downstairs! Going downstairs! Why is there a baby crying? Holy crap, what is this? Why is this blocked? Okay. Open up the door. No. Locked. Okay. Oh my ha oh god, ha have what? Okay, why is there no light here? What the freaking crap? Okay, we're back in the garage. Okay. Okay, we've made it out alive. We're in the car right now. Everything's fine and dandy. I'm just gonna pretend like this is just a big old nightmare. Oh! So we were the killers? I'm stuck at the gate. You were no, just the two of us in here. See you soon. Oh my god. What is even happening here? Okay, what? Why are we in the same room again? New objective, find a way to vanquish the spirit. I don't want to fucking vanquish any spirit, man. What are you talking about? Do these people just not pay the light bill? What is going on here? Why is it that every single horror game, there's never ever any lights? Okay, it's not nice. It's truly scary. I'm about to play some Nintendo because fuck it. You got you got Super Mario, uh, Super Mario Brothers in here, bro. I'm not dead. <laughs> oh, okay, that was so good. Oh, thanks. I feel so empty now. Oh. Okay, so now I need to find out how I can vanquish the spirit, and it. And then now everything is just all made a full mess. I, I don't know how we got here in the first place. 
All I wanted to do was get my wife's plane ticket. Hello? Please listen. I I know this is my house and I I I I I I wanna let I wanna let you know that you are welcomed here, but you know, I, it'd be very nice if you just leave somewhere else, cause you know, I just I don't like this shit. And I, I need you to go, uh Hello? Am I speaking to myself? I, I probably am. Okay, this is this is my theater room. It's a hot mess. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Turn that off. Who turned that off? Turn that off. Turn it off! God. Okay, good. This is the controller. Okay, so we can use the controller. Just to turn on and turn off the TV. It's great. All right, so I'm going to check the uh, machine again. We got some cigarettes here. Nice. Uh, uh, no need to smoke right now. I'm nervous as a shit. I definitely don't want to smoke. What the fuck is that? Okay. Making my way to the kitchen now. If there's any demons here. Oh. There's a, there's a knife. Okay, that's, that's fucking weird. That's actually the knife that I probably killed my wife with, which makes it a whole lot scarier. Okay. Listen up. We've got some news hot off the presses. Tragedy has struck Pleasant Fall. A woman was found murdered in her home. She was brutally stabbed over 10 times. The victim's name was Sarah Powell. Sarah managed to make a call to 911 before she succumbed to her injuries. The primary suspect of this brutal murder is believed to be her husband, Gary Pout. He was found deceased only mere blocks away, slumped over the steering wheel of his car after a fatal collision with a tree. The murder weapon was found in the car with him, leading investigators to speculate that he crashed his car while fleeing the scene of the crime. The couple had a daughter believed to be 19 years of age, but police have been unsuccessful in tracking her down. If anyone knows the location, oh. contact Pleasant Falls PD immediately. It is also believed that Sarah has been a victim to domestic abuse. If you or someone you know is suffering from domestic abuse, get help before it's too late. What in the world happened in this house? Domestic abuse? Are you kidding me? I love my little girl. Okay, shut up. I guess it's time to go back inside the horror. <laughs> Okay. Hello? Got a journal? Who is he? My thoughts are dark. Black as night. Life is sparse. A total absence of light. When it's all over, come find me there. Holy fuck. That is dark. What is going on here? Yeah, I'm not... 6, 1999. My hands are shaking as I write this. Maggie's gone. Michael's gone. And Gary's gone too. At least the man I love is. It's just me and the monster living inside Gary. And the beatings are getting worse and I'm running out of excuses. I'm so tired. The lady next door came over yesterday. She must have heard something. She urged me to call the police, but I just can't do it. I love Gary so much. He's never gotten over Michael leaving us. And he blames me. Maybe it is my fault. All he does is drink. Locked in that basement day and night reading those weird books. He's so unhinged now. What do I do? I can't abandon him. I know Gary's in there somewhere and I'll be right here when he surfaces again. Fuck, this is so hard. I have to stay strong for him. Okay. Nice. Oh! Gary! Michael! Oh, fuck 
this shit! It's all gone now, boys. It's all... <sighs> Everything is locked. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait a minute. This was not here before. Look in the mirror. I see only a husk. Uh, excuse me, but I don't want to look in the- <laughs> Oh, fucking shit! <gasps> in the basement. Dude, my ass is throbbing right now. I cannot take this. Oh, that's the damn mirror. I don't want to look in the mirror, bro. Okay. Oh, fuck. Do we look in the mirror? Do we look in the mirror? Oh, God. Here we go. gonna pop up I know it oh 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 you'll lose your soul the wall lies beyond insanity or whatever the hell so everything just flipped upside down Everything is reversed now. Okay, well, that's not that bad. Yeah, this ain't that bad, bro. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to go to the basement. Holy fuck. Okay. Hear me out. Okay, hold on. Alright, let's go. Let's go to the basement then, shall we? Let's go to the damn basement. Well, we've got a lot of pretty paintings in here, <laughs> to say the least. I don't want to say they're ugly, because I really don't want to upset the demons that lie be, 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 but under... Oh, no. That's how I'm going to shut up. Underneath my house. Okay? So, what is this? What am I supposed to do here? Okay, maybe. No. Everything is just backwards. Oh! <gasps> Dude, there's so many useful weapons here throughout this little playthrough, and it's kind of bummed out that I can't get any of them. See, like, right now? <laughs> right now would be an important uh, moment to give me this fucking crowbar. Okay. This is the mask. We've got a book. The spell contained within this book are your pathways to power beyond your human ability to imagine. For once you to learn the uh for once you to learn the in in intricacies of a wielding such power, the book and the and the and the and the rices within will no longer be needed. Your body and soul will become a conflict for the darkness or conduit. Whatever, man. Dark power and energy will be craft, uh, transferred through you in into... I'm not even gonna read this shit. Just in case it actually happens to be in real life. But this is supposed to be some sort of ritual. Um, objective complete. Find a way to vanquish the spirit. Angry spirits are born in violent death. 
The set, uh, to set the spirit free, you will need to perform a ritual. For this ritual, you will need to gather the following objects belonging to the angry spirit. A body of the deceased, any part of the remains. Okay, that's disgusting. Image of the deceased, clothing worn in the eyes of God. An object of uh, ancestral significance. Once collected, cleanse the objects with fire and spread the ashes over the site where they were slain. Holy crap. <laughs> where is there a fucking Bible here? Hello? gonna hide behind this box okay um oh god what the fuck is happening hello oh, shit. Ah! oh my freaking christ no! Please, 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 please. Oh, God! Stop it, stop it. Listen to me, listen to me, listen to me. Oh, the oh fucking shit! Oh! Was found murdered in her home. Stabbed over ten. Managed times. to make a call to 911. Have been victim to domestic me, abuse. Just me. living in my dozy's drink. Maybe it is my fault. Yeah, Abandoned here. Care so find some of her remains. <laughs>